Uh, we're in Ruski today, my home village. Um, over the river there you see uh, the Weir Lodge. That's where my mother was born over the bar in that premises that my uh, grandfather Martin and his wife Bridie owned. And then next door to that is Peter Reynolds' pub and next door to that is the Shannon Key West Hotel where originally there was a building called The Beaches that my grandparents on my father's side used to live with their family until they moved over to Shannon and uh, they built their own house up the village and eventually established the bacon factory which was uh, Hanley's Bacon Factory which was taken over by Glambia in 1989 and lasted about another 14 years before it burnt down and the village never really recovered since. There was a bit of a respite back in I guess 2006, 2007 time when the building boom was going on but uh, after the crisis in 2008 things really haven't recovered here. It's a very picturesque village down here. Uh, it deserves a chance to rebuild itself uh, to see the prosperity that was once here return. Like back in the 80s uh, there was full employment here. There was uh, 500 people employed in the factory. Uh, somebody mentioned that I mean people didn't have to emigrate unless they wanted to. Uh, you know, there was always something in Ruski for them and it prospered and, you know, a lot of people came to the place, the boats going, I remember the boats when I was younger, coming up and down the Shannon, uh, fishermen from Germany, uh, England especially, they'd all come around here and they all had memories of Ruski and so many people anywhere I've been in Ireland, I tell them I'm from Ruski and they say, oh, I remember Ruski on the Shannon. It, it deserves a chance to rebuild itself and it can happen there's a, a high amenity area here that we have here but it'll be the it'll be the people of Ruski that do it there there won't be any help from outside the hotel back in 2011 closed down i remember it was good restaurant good bar well-run establishment and unfortunately with the downturn it uh, was closed but um it was the hub of uh, the village for a lot of years there uh, birthdays, weddings, it was a shame to see it go and like I mean the, the village hasn't really recovered since and it really needs its hotel back. It could be the start of something, you know, uh, a revival in the local area and that's what the area needs. Uh, people need it and uh, I think it's now is the time for uh, a redevelopment of the area and unfortunately with uh, the proposed direct provision centre that they're talking about uh, putting into it, uh, you can write all that off. That's not going to happen. Uh, the, the boats that come through here in the summer and that, they're not going to stop. Uh, I, I really can't see uh, how any development will come around the place if that uh, direct provision centre comes into the area. As far as I can tell, talking to people here, that they don't want, um, they, they really feel uh, that, that the people coming in here having their protest, like they've nothing got to do with the area. They don't know the people here. Uh, they really feel like they're being intruded upon and being told how to think and how to feel about the whole situation. The locals here have had enough of their behaviour and we'd rather be left to our own devices, thank you very much. And, uh, and that goes for the Department of Justice and uh, the government as well, because they've done nothing for this area for so many years. And then they like, uh, without discussion, without anything, come along and uh, want to slap this on the people of Ruski after all the years that they've put up with everything. And uh, I mean, this government have done nothing for the area, nothing and all the politicians and that that are running around the place uh, they've all gone to ground now uh, with this potential direct provision centre so uh, and I, I hope the hotel does open up as a hotel in the future and we'll just see how many of them turn up for the opening day if it does happen and I really hope it does happen 